Tuesday in the coop. Uh, got Rachel Davis with me. Hey. So, uh, you know, we both did some no hook grip snatches. And we actually moved our feet, so you can see I'm working on popping my feet out. Um, but working on grip work and just hitting the bottom of the squat. And Rachel started out with squats. We did reverse because there's only so much room in here. We got a garage gym now, so. Doesn't it look nice, all those banners? Come on. Yeah, we got a lot of cool banners and pictures. Super pumped with it. So Rachel, her goal was to do <laughs> 131 for three sets of five for a PR three sets of five. And last week I did 130, so I was like, yeah, I'm gonna increase by one kilo. <laughs> but after that 125, we decided, you know, it's a good deload week because that 125 looked tough. Yeah, and that was just for a single. Mm -hmm. So as you can see here, we think that was definitely the right choice. And 110 was a really good choice of weight because she was able to move it quick. But get enough work in to improve. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and even those last couple of reps were, <laughs> were a little challenging. This is my second set, and they felt stronger as my sets went along. Yeah, when Rachel does three sets of five on the squat, her squats actually get better and better as the workout goes on. So you'll see that the second set is a little better. And even though she's struggling, um, she is keeping her chest up, which is something that uh, Glenn and Don have been working with her on changing her, her squat technique. And that took a long time. That was a, a year in the making of breaking it down and rebuilding those muscles so I can sit deeply and keep my chest up. Mm -hmm. And while I was waiting for the squat rack, I just wanted to work on some flexibility. So, I did some squat jerks. Woo woo, last set for me. 110, yeah, this is the best one. Yeah, so you can see the speed on the first one, second one. You know, the last couple got, got tough, but, I mean, she's moving a lot better on this last set. I always find it amazing on three sets of five. I'll, I'll see the first set and I'll be like, I don't know. <laughs> no way. <laughs> yep, I'm under the watchful eye of James Tatum back there. <laughs> yeah. James was missing today, but we will see him tomorrow. Yep. He's never really missing, though. <laughs> yeah, we always got that, that banner of him, so he's always in the gym with us. Um, yeah, so just up to 60 with these. These just really help my lockout and work on the muscles to push the bar overhead. And then we switch positions, and, and I was over here in the front doing my squats. I did three sets of five at 180 today. Um, did 175 last week, and... Rachel said this set looked tough. She was putting me down. I don't think it looked that bad. <laughs> well, you can't hear it, but it was. It sounded like it was a lot harder than <laughs> his, his other sets. They got a lot stronger, but <laughs> he was, I would say, struggling, but it wasn't with ease. All right, and this is me doing, I'm doing no hook snatches, and I'm moving, am I moving my feet right here? Not on the first okay. set. So after this set, I was like, hey, Rachel, try to move your feet. Yes and be quicker with your uh, turnover. Faster. So as she gets up to about 70 kilos, you'll see how much faster they look. Here's my second set. I think uh, this was your best set, I think. Oh, nice. Yeah, the workout definitely got nice. um, better nice with the squats. Workout. Really wasn't too bad once I got warmed right. up. And Yeah, see, he's killing this set. The set before was a little slower, oh, just saying. <laughs> yeah, see, those are a lot quicker. You can see that turnover, it just it looks better. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it felt better. I think this second rep is a good one. Um, let's see. Yeah, yeah, that was a good one. So our last set of squats and, you know, squat days, they maybe aren't the most exciting to watch, but um, hopefully you guys can kind of understand what we do on these strength days, uh, get a feel. Um, nice, basically, just prioritizing the squat on Tuesdays, right, Thursdays, and Saturdays, and or um, push presses and overhead movements. And um, we still do lifts, but they're lighter. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, work more technique. And Travis was giving me some tips. Really, really trying to get fast for me and just thinking faster and uh, expecting the bar to be faster and getting under. Yeah, that was a good one. Yeah, so for a super, Rachel is really athletic. So I think her advantage as a super is that she is athletic. And so really emphasizing her strength and focusing on it is going to be important to reaching the top levels. I mean, those look really good. Yeah, I'm pumped about that. Moved on to power cleans and did, did two doubles at 85 on your top sets. Yeah, this first double uh, is, is pretty good. I jumped from 65 to 85, which... 
I'm not used to doing, so it was a little bit of a shock, but the second double here is pretty strong. Yeah, right. especially that first rep. Yeah, that looks super easy, so. Yeah, my best double's only about 10 kilos more than this, so definitely got That's more nice. in the tape for this exercise. You can tell I'm excited. <laughs> then Rachel was trying the squat jerks. I wasn't sure. Sometimes she pushes the bar in front on the jerk, so I think this exercise really teaches you to get the head through and use the muscles you need to to support the weight overhead. That looks really good. I hadn't seen that until now. That looked really good. Yeah. So then I worked on just kind of pausing in the bottom, kind of a similar thing as the squat jerk, just really making sure my lockout's good and controlling the weight. Just at light weights, you know. And then um, here's how much fun Rachel was having <laughs> at training today. <laughs> today was a lot of fun, actually. It was a good Tuesday. Yeah, so we'll see you tomorrow. James will be here. We'll be putting up a little more heavy on the, um, on the Olympic lifts. All right, peace out.